Can Fiat, an Italian brand, really harness the die-hard American spirit embodied by the Jeep brand? The answer is right beside me in the form of the 2014 Jeep Cherokee, a revived nameplate meant to replace the outgoing Liberty. This car is based on the same platform as the Alfa Romeo Giulietta and the Dodge Dart. But in this case it comes with two engine options, either a 2.4 liter four-cylinder with 184 horsepower or your choice of a 3.2 liter version of Chrysler's Pentastar V6 with 271 horsepower. Those engines are both mated to a nine-speed automatic transmission that, in the four-cylinders case, is capable of delivering up to 31 highway miles per gallon. But more than any of that, talk is sure to center around this car's styling. After weeks and weeks of leaks and images coming out onto the internet, we're finally getting a chance to look at this car in person here at the 2013 New York Auto Show. You've no doubt seen, heard, or probably even participated in the online criticism surrounding this car's styling. Most of that's been around its split front headlights and its creased front grille. Some have said it looks like the Juke, others the Pontiac Aztec. Shudder to think so, but the fact remains that this car is a vast departure from Jeep's traditional styling. That might not be a bad thing though, because this car actually looks better in person than it does on camera. You can always count on an interesting interior from the Jeep brand, be it from the no-nonsense Wrangler all the way down to the Compass. That's certainly the case here, although you're getting an evolution on Jeep's interiors. A few key highlight features include these very well-bolstered seats that you might not expect to find inside of a Jeep, but are actually standard with the car. Aside from that, you also get a standard touchscreen, although the model we have here is the 8-inch and the 5-inch touchscreen is the standard unit. You also get a TFT display, and apart from that, cool features like hideaway storage in the seats just like you'd find in the Dart. Just like the Fiat 500C, there's also an available retractable ragtop. The car we're sitting in is the Trailhawk Edition, which apart from the cool stitching on the seats and little extras for the interior, comes with an extra inch of ride height, red tow hooks at the front and rear, skid plates underneath, and a better approach angle for when you really want to go off-roading. Of course, in the end, it's really up to you to decide whether or not you think this European take on the Jeep brand will end up paying off. Love it or hate it, it does have at least one thing going for it out of the gate. With a 4,500 pound tow rating, it's already best in class, at least in one sense.